Hey boys, it's Arm Nan. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a few of my iconic outfits in Grand Theft Auto Online. Now, believe it or not, this is actually a pretty heavily requested video of mine. So today, I felt like it was only right to do it. The first step in our great journey today is to head to your localist clothing store. And in order to do that, we will need a car, so we're going to have to commandeer one. Once you've uh, got your automobile of choice, it's time to head over to the nearest clothing store. Once you have arrived at your nearest clothing store, make sure you park your car very carefully, not hurting anybody in the process. Once you've quietly entered the neighborhood of the clothing store, you will now enter inside. Hmm. Now, the outfits in which we are making today are, of course, this one here, which is my classic PvP outfit. If you guys have seen any of my PvP videos, this is the one that I almost always wear. Is she talking? We'll fix that later. So, in order to make this outfit, there are a few things that you are going to need, and we're going to go ahead and start off with the tops. Now, in order to make this outfit, you're going to go all the way down to the bottom and go to Utility Tops. Underneath Utility Tops, you're going to want to select the Black Battle Vest. Once you've got that, you're going to want to go into Utility Vests, and you're going to want to equip the Light Strike Vest. Now, I have used other ones of these in the past for this same outfit. However, I have found that I like the Light Strike Vest the best. Once you've got that, you're going to want to head over to the Pants here. You're going to want to go down to Team Pants, and within the Team Pants, you're going to want to select the Black Combat Pants. Now, these do come with the boots, so fear not. Next up, for one of the less complicated things that we have to do, you're going to want to head over to the accessories area in the store. Now under accessories, you're going to want to go to gloves, and you're going to want to pick out some black gloves. I have the black leather gloves, which I'm really not sure, because usually I feel like I rock the tactical. But anyways, the black leather gloves do work. Now, one of the final components that we will need is underneath the hats category. And within the hats category, you're going to want to go down to combat helmets. Within the combat helmets, you're going to want to select the Tiger Quad Lens. The Quad Lens is the only one to get because it allows you to have thermal without use of the thermal scope on the heavy sniper, even though I prefer to use the thermal scope anyways. Now, once you've bought all of these things, it's time to head back outside and get back into our car. You will not survive this. I'm sorry. Get back in the car and head down to the mask shop by the beach. Now, there is something to be said. You must be careful on your approach to the mask shop. There are a lot of civilians around and you would not want to injure any of them or hurt them in any manner. Now that we've successfully cleared the area around the mask shop, we can just enter into it. Except it's closed and we must come back later. I'm sorry. And now that the mask shop is back open, we can carefully walk up. Now, once you get to the mask shop, you're going to want to go ahead and scroll down to ski masks. Now, I have the Sand Tactical Ski Mask equipped on my character, as you guys can see. So this is the one that you're going to want to pick with your helmet. Now, you can actually wear this with the helmet without doing the telescope glitch, which is pretty nice. So you're going to want to equip that. And once you've got all of that equipped, you're simply going to want to go into the interaction menu, go to style, go to parachute and show your parachute bag as on. Obviously, I have the black chute, so that's the one I rock. So that's it for the first outfit. Let's get into the second one. For this again, you're going to want to come to your localist clothing store and enter the building. Now, this outfit that I'm going to be showing you guys is actually very similar to this one. The next one is, of course, the covert desert outfit. Now, this one is slightly more complicated, but not that bad. To start off with, you're going to want to go to tops. Similar to the last one, utility tops as well. And this one, I have the beige battle vest equipped. Now you're going to want to go into utility vests and you're going to want to scroll all the way down to the black plate carrier. Once you've done that, you're going to want to come over to the pants, go down to the team pants again, and you're going to want to select the black combat pants. Next up, you're going to want to go to the hats. Underneath the hats, go to combat helmets again and pick up the black quad lens. Again, once you've done that, you're going to want to go over to the gloves. For this outfit, the gloves that I have selected are the black tactical gloves, which actually should be on the other outfit, I believe. So once you've equipped those, you're now going to want to go to the scarves. This is where you are going to need the telescope glitch. So you're going to want to make sure that you have the black desert scarf purchased. It is essential. I probably should have told you guys to do that before we got into anything else on this outfit. So make sure that you have the black desert scarf purchased. Next up, now that we're back at the mask shop, you're going to want to enter in here. Go down to gas masks and you're going to want to make sure you purchase the black respirator. Once you have all of these things, you're going to want to head over to the other side of the pier and go to one of the telescopes. 
So before we come to the telescope, what you're going to want to do is just equip your helmet. So you're going to want to make sure you have the black quad lens equipped before we get into any of this stuff. Next up, you're going to sprint past the telescope and enter into it. You'll know that you've done it right when your character removes the helmet entirely and just comes and stands in front of the telescope just like this. Then you enter into the interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, and from here you're going to want to go ahead and equip the black respirator under the masks under accessories. Then once you've got it equipped, you're going to just simply walk away. Once you walk away, the helmet will come back just like you guys just saw, and for some reason the respirator isn't there. So if this happens for some strange reason, go into style and what you're going to want to do is actually go to your masks and equip the black respirator off the bat. Now what we're going to do is sprint past the telescope again, enter into it, and as you guys can see, the respirator has been removed. So now we're going to go back into style, go to accessories, go to helmets, and we're going to go ahead and equip the black quad lens again. Now we're going to exit out and simply walk away, and as you guys should see here, yes, we've done it. So we've got the black gas mask on and we have the black tactical combat helmet equipped as well. Now for you guys, you will not have the black desert scarf equipped yet. So at this point, once you've got this, I would recommend going back to the clothing store and saving your outfit to make sure that you save your progress. Then once you've done that, come back to the telescope and we're going to do it all over again. Sprint past, enter in, do it just like I did right there. Now you're going to go back into style, go to accessories, you're going to want to scroll down to the scarves, equip the black desert scarf, and exit out yet again, and just walk away. And as you guys can see, now I have the black desert scarf, I have the black gas mask, and the black tactical helmet as well. So guys, that's how you make it. If this video helped you out, if you guys enjoyed this, if you want to know how to make more of my outfits in Grand Theft Auto Online, let me know in the comments down below, or if you just want more outfit tutorials in general, let me know in the comments down below, I'm sure that I can go ahead and make some more. If you guys enjoyed this video, a like is of course appreciated, if not dislike of course. Subscribe if you guys are new, and I will see you all in the next video. Until then, take care. Peace.